everybody this is Chase with Keller Williams and we're here at one of my favorite type of houses sarcasm included an agent owner property so there is a newer roof on the property um, I just I feel like agents should know better on certain items um, and I'm gonna point a bunch of those out to you guys so AC is actually functioning. Uh, it's freezing cold. That's great news. Um, we got this big green tarp mat killing some grass in the backyard, which is terrible. The axis is on the back of the house, so we're walking through the garage door into this giant mess in the garage. Um, just We don't know what this is from. There's just a whole bunch of junk on the floor. Um, older hot water heater, but newer electrical panel as well. So we're gonna walk into this seemingly nice kitchen. And I'll point out a couple of the flaws here um, after you get to see brand new appliances and new cabinets. Um, we have this old wood laminate but it's a new countertop. And then for the absolute winner, we got new flooring and we have the floor as the backsplash with some crappy cuts. It's not even cut to size, but this is, this is pieces of the wood laminate floor. It used as backsplash with some brown caulking too. It's a, uh, man, it, it's special tell you that much it, it's just so bad it's embarrassing but it from a distance I mean you can't even tell so moving along um, we got a new sliding glass patio door we have just the, again the little things is what matters we got outlets that, that don't match the outlet covers you know some people overlook that that's no big deal but doesn't take much to change that. We've got cords and cabinets and dust and dirt and grime and this giant contraption in the living room. All the shades shut so it's nice and dark in here. Here's a bathroom that was recently redone. So I have a new stool black and neutralish tile got an old vanity no lights no light bulbs whatsoever uh, seemingly newer tub and new tile shower in here but then we got you know gold towel bar a new door with stickers still on it not painted old hardware no GFCI outlets in the bath, which isn't the end of the world, but still be nice to have. Here's a master on the first floor, big walk-in closet, but no light bulb. Another new door with a sticker still on it, old hardware. Same thing here, new door, sticker still on, not painted old hardware <clears throat> you can see outside from inside the door isn't put on right got gold hinges here and silver hardware here I'm gonna go upstairs got nice wood floor Again, we got new doors on everything. Some new hardware even, but we're not gonna paint it. We're gonna put a new hardware on this. But we're gonna leave the old crusty crappy hardware on these doors and not paint anything. Leave the sticker on it. And then just paint over this old crappy hardware it's just, it's, it's really terrible. 
And then to top it all off, we got this bit bathroom. Gorgeous, really nice wood faux tile that's grouted. We got this door. Again, kind of my pet peeve. Beautiful tile. Tile for a border. And then you have this awful half textured but running down the wall. Not painted. Textured right over the outlet. Mirror is not hung. Got this wonderful outlet, or not outlet, lighting fixture. More untextured. Beautiful tile work. New hardware. Brand new tub. New tile. Nice backsplash. New stool. Then this god awful falling apart vanity with a non matching top that's cracked in places. It's got some paint on it. I don't know how because they didn't paint this. I mean, just why can't you finish a project? All right, that's about enough venting for me. I apologize, but I mean, agents, agents know better than to do stuff like this. And uh, this is an agent owner house and they obviously don't know any better. This is Chase with Seminole, Ke Seminole Keller Williams out.